How we doing today? Welcome to Snake Clips and today we're going to be doing something I haven't done in a long time. It's called in-hand feeding. In-hand feeding was started by a gentleman in one of the other forums um, and what he would do is he would actually hold his snakes while he fed them and he would hold them while they would eat their food and he started a group and a group of us would uh, post pictures and, and video clips and everything of us doing the exact same thing. Um, some of us, most of them, would use small baby snakes just in case they got bit. Um, but the more the people that were in there that were more experienced would use larger snakes. Like I'm using this white sided rat snake today, which is about between five and six feet long. Um, but he's a great eater. He never gives me any problems when he eats. So I'm using him today to demonstrate this to you. Uh, a lot of people don't think this would be quote unquote politically correct to do something like this. Uh, but Snake Man is not politically correct and never will be. So I like to have a little fun sometimes and like I said, doing it this way is really awesome. Um, it shows you that just because a snake is in a feeding mode that he doesn't necessarily associate every single thing with food. You'll notice this snake has no inkling in trying to bite me during this process here. Uh, so I just wanted to show you it's going to be a short clip um, if you like what you see hit the like button if you want to subscribe and see some more weird and stupid stuff that we do hit the subscribe button and uh, as I say always keep it real and be safe guys okay we used to have a club that was called the in-hand feeding club and that's when you take your snake you'd hold it up in the air like this and you would actually offer him food and hold it for him hold him while he was eating it uh, not a very popular club now because uh, people were always afraid of getting bit. It's not politically correct. It might stress out the snake a little. But Jerry the Snake Man is not always politically correct. We're going to see if this guy wants to eat. And yep, look at him. He's going to take that from us. Go ahead, buddy. And we're going to stand here and hold him while he eats it. And we're going to feed him three of these. I had taking out some frozen mice and they were all frozen together in a big clump so I couldn't really separate them so uh, I thawed them all out and I had three basically small mice hoppers um, that I couldn't use with anybody else who wanted to eat them right now so I thought you know what let me show you our in-hand feeding club that we used to do pretty cool um, you gotta watch though. I mean, feeding is normally when you get bit by most snakes. Not a lot of snakes, uh, I should say some snakes, won't do an in hand feed because of the fact that they have to be very trusting snakes. Uh, a lot of snakes, if there's a lot of motion or anything going on, um, they decide not to eat for you. And this is the case sometimes because when a snake has his mouth full, he's basically unable to defend himself. So that's usually the time that this snake will decide that he's not going to eat. So now let me see. I'll get him a second one here. He's pretty much finished the first one. Just has the tail hanging out. You're going to take a second one? Or are you going to wait till you finish that one? Hmm? Yeah? You're going to wait till you finish that? Okay. Go ahead. You can go ahead and swallow that one. Yes. Swallow it down. Get that tail down. Here you go. Right here. Over here. Here's another one for you. I got another one. You want that one too? Yeah. Go ahead. Go on. You can have it. You want that? It's right there. No, over here. I know. Here you go. You don't take things hard, do you, huh? You want this one? This is a good one. Come on. Come on. You're normally a guy that'll eat just about anything. There you go. I know you want it. I know you want it. There you go. There you go. There you go. Go ahead. This guy's a very delicate eater the way he takes food from you. He's really cool though. This guy will even eat strips of raw chicken. Uh, any type of raw meat will pretty much take. Um, he's not an aggressive eater as you can see. Doesn't really strike at his food. He knows it's uh, all ready for him just to swallow it down. And like I said, you'd watch people, they'd use king snakes, uh, they would use rat snakes. Most of the time, though, they would only use baby snakes because they were always afraid of getting bit by the larger snakes. I actually uh, in hand fed um, 
one of my seven foot boa constrictors but again I, I trust them and I know how they eat like this guy here he's a very delicate eater and we got one more mouse for him here hopefully he'll take it here you go buddy one more come on I don't want to have to find somebody else to take this come on you can have it come on there you you know you want it there you opened your mouth that was my fault I'm sorry I'm sorry there you go I almost ate my tongs that time but it's really amazing how snakes get to trust you like this guy here he's so trusting that he's willing to give up his most um, opportunistic uh, that's the wrong word his most vulnerable moment while he's chewing and swallowing his food he trusts the fact that I'm not going to attack him um, very awesome that snakes can go to that point um, that they trust you completely like he does here um, if he didn't have trust in me there was no way that he would do that now again as you can see he's not trying to bite at me definitely he's in a feeding mode right now because he just ate three mice but look at that he's not trying to attack me in any way shape or form um, he knows I'm not food so you know a lot of people blow that feeding stuff out of proportion um, it's just individual snakes this particular snake here is one of the really cool snakes like I said trust me he's very docile when he takes his food um, a great, great snake, and he is actually a white-sided black rat snake.